Hey guys, Mechanic CG here and welcome back to another episode of Forza Motorsport. Today is episode number 6. If you guys do enjoy the video, make sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe, and let's get into the content. This video was streamed live on Twitch. Come watch us live with the link in the description. Alright, so we're going to move on to the uh, mid-engine event. Uh, and we've got Maple Valley... Tokyo Circuit and Silverstone. This is the old Silverstone Circuit, and I think this circuit was actually featured all the way up until Forza Motorsport 5, so it's going to be quite nice to actually experience the old track again. All right, here we go. We got the NSX, and apparently this is the second fastest car in this, which, um... I don't know why. I'm a little bit surprised by that. Oh, but I've absolutely destroyed that, um, VX220. Hey, hey, hey. What would you do if someone was paid to bring you what you are owed, but goes and fucks your brother and steals all your money? I got no clue. <laughs> Don't think I've ever been in that situation. This car's got some speed, my G. <laughs> Is the friend you? No comment. <laughs> no comment. It's a no man automation now. The writing's on the wall. Yeah, I bet when uh, Forza was it, um, creating this game back in 2005 that they weren't even thinking about electric cars now we're in 2020 every single video game is now starting to think about adding electric cars into their games god what i'd do to go back to the old days <laughs> aaron the, the quality of these uh, dad jokes are going downhill quite quickly now <laughs> <laughs> I've messed that one up. You just run a automation now. This is such a tune. We got some good tunes today, chat. This song was actually featured in a lot of racing games back in like 2008 to 2010, 2011. One of the big ones I remember was uh, Motorstorm Arctic Edge. For the PSP and the PS2 actually had this song in it. Oh, and it slapped then. It slapped then and it still slaps now. Oh, bit of a corner cut there. Not ideal, but we'll take it. Whoa. Meow. <laughs> we slide backwards. Slide into those DMs. Give me my rewards. Thank you. Alright, here we go. Tokyo Circuit. Nice. Got a good start so far. we got to get in front of this car. Because, in all honesty, as long as I get in front for this first corner, I don't really care about the rest of the track. Oh, I accidentally shifted into reverse. That's not ideal. <laughs> I 
Why was the coach yelling at the vending machine? He wanted his quarterback. See, that's much better. <laughs> that's a much better joke. Atticacy. I assume that's an American football joke. An vending machine joke, if you want to call it that. This thing's speedy. 120 miles an hour already. Do you know the cool thing is? This game actually portrays speed a lot better. I know why. 120 miles an hour seems fast in this game, but you go to 120 miles an hour on Gran Turismo Sport or uh, Forza Motorsport 7, for example, it just feels really slow. Come play my game, I'll test ya. Yeah. There we go, very nice. First lap completed. Oh, that was way too close. Oh. Do you know, actually, that probably slowed me down quicker than if I used my brakes. Let's be honest. <laughs> we got away with it. I might have to stand up in a minute, I think. I can feel pins and needles coming along in my leg. <laughs> They're always coughing. <laughs> That's a good one. The Acura NSX. I See, here's the thing. I don't understand why Honda is known as Acura in... America, but it's also known as Honda. Like, you get Hondas in America and you get Acuras in America. And it's only America that Acura actually exists. And in American video games as well. Which Forza Motorsport is an American video game. Forza Horizon is British. Motorsport is American. It's a very, uh, Confusing concept. Psychosomatic Atticus Sane. There we go. 342. Not bad. We'll take six grand. Getting close to level 14 as well. All right, here we go. We're at Silverstone. Ooh, I just ran up and down the stairs to grab a drink. I've just started recording straight away because I'm behind schedule. <laughs> I need to get all the level 5 and the level 10 stuff done today, hopefully. Oh! Wow, the frame rate. Hey, no worries, Aaron. Go have fun in VR. Hopefully we'll see you again later. Very nice, going through maggots. And now Beckett. Silverstone is such a lovely track. When it comes to games like Forza and stuff like that. It's good to drive around. But it doesn't make for very entertaining racing. Unless you're daft and you do that like I do. Ooh. I'll somehow save it. It does seem like this track, the um, time is running a little slow, which normally means it's lagging. Magic people, voodoo people.
Still got Sir Fallen as a simp boss in chat. I need to um, program up a simp boss for YouTube. But when it comes to like video premieres, we can have a simp boss for YouTube. But I don't know how we can do that. Because I can't use my main bot software to do that. Mess this corner up big time. Way too wide there. Come on, we got this. <laughs> Invaders must die by the prodigy. Man, this is bringing back. I think it was Wipeout 2048 that had this song in it. I don't know. I've, I've, I'm 95% sure they actually added it back for the Omega collection for PS4, which was basically Wipeout 2048, but in 4K rather than 540p, whatever it was on the Vita. And also added um, the old Wipeouts from PS3. We should do a Wipeout stream. Just because why not? Because I can. Do, 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 do. New, 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 new. Go, lovely. Invaders must die. There we go. 424. Not bad. Hang on. They've got the NSXR from Honda in this, and they've got the Acura version. That's even more confusing now. Why? Sure. Do what you want. <laughs> Stupid game. There we go. We got uh, six grand and we got Magneti Morelli giving modified engine tuning upgrades a discount. And then I think we'll also get the Lancia Stratos HF Stradale. Lovely car that is. Right. Roadster challenge. We're taking the uh, MR2. We've uh, upgraded it a tiny bit as well. So we've got a little bit more performance. Uh, we're going to be going around Alpine Ring, Laguna Seca, and then Road America. Now, this one, I'm very excited because uh, Road America is a good track. All right, here we go. Alpine Ring in the MR2. Oh, that thing's got some speed off the line. Oh, my God. I want my banana hole to suffer for my sadness. Okay, you do you, Fallen. <laughs> I'ma just say, uh, I'ma pass on that one, Chief. I don't like that that Porsche is really close on my bunda. Or my banana hole, as Fallen likes to call it. <laughs> Excuse me, what? 
My banana hole's not suffering for your sadness. <laughs> oh my god. So they call me Spitfire. Oh, I really gotta get a new power supply. I think that when I get my Twitch payout, that's what that's going towards is a new power supply. What's even worse though is I'm gonna have to rewire my entire PC because when I get, I've got a um, um, non-modular one at the moment, and the one I'm looking for, well, because it's non-modular, I have to redo it anyways. But the one I'm looking for is fully modular, so. I'm going to get probably some red cables or something like that. Just to liven it up a bit inside. But yeah, I need new power supply. That I can. Yes, Fallen? You have screamed my name in chat. Has your RGB RAM arrived yet? Is that why you've screamed m my name? Ah, yeah, ah, yeah. This MR2 is a lovely car, by the way. It's nice and smooth to drive. My motherboard came with a 20% off coupon for cable mod that I'm not going to use. I I'd appreciate that. Cable mod's the one where you get custom cables, isn't it? You can change the colours completely. Yeah, I wouldn't mind that. There we go. MR2. Woohoo! 6,400. Give me my credits. Get out. Alright, here we go. We're at, um... Laguna Seca. Cheers that, Jacob. I'll, um, sort it out after stream. I'll have a look at it then and I'll send over the software that I use. I'll take a brain to another dimension. I take your brain to another dimension. Pay close attention. Here we go. Oh god, I burped. <laughs> I take your brain to another dimension. I take your brain to another dimension. Pay close attention. There's so many good prodigy songs, it's unreal. I don't know what to listen to next. I don't know whether we should listen to Of Mice and Men. Get some uh, heavy metal in on the stream. Could do. Could do that. Obviously not going to play heavy metal on the actual YouTube recording. I don't know if it's 32-bit or 64, to be honest. I'm pretty sure the emulator is 64-bit still. Illuminate. But 32 bit will still work fine. There might be a couple of weird things with it, but it will it should still work. Windows is pretty good at emulating 32 bit versions of apps. Cause that's what it does, it runs an emulator on all 32 bit apps. Radiate. Ten thousand degrees. Radiate. 10,000 degrees. Nice. How are you playing this game on PC? I'm not. I am emulating. Uh, I'm not even emulating. I'm native hardware. Playing it straight off an Xbox 360. Because uh, Xbox 360 emulation isn't quite there yet. It's good, but it's not quite there. So it's just easier playing it off the native hardware. Plus, this game relies hev When you notice... When you go through like a heavily populated area on this game, um, you do notice the frames drop dramatically. And that is sort of a telltale sign that this game is based off of frames rendered rather than just 
it simulates it on the CPU and then renders images after. You can tell, like, everything is rendered as one thing. Therefore, if you emulate and something goes a little bit slow, yeah, the whole thing's fucked. You're just going to get lagging constantly. So at least this is lags only a tiny bit during for very short periods of time. Here we go. Coming around that final corner. Slow it down. Oh yeah, you'll need to get PS2 BIOS. I'll sort you out with that one, don't worry. And there we go. 324, not bad. I'm going to save that replay, because I don't know which ones I've saved. So, let's go. 6,400, lovely. Road America! Because it's in America. And it's a road. Come with me to the dance floor. Watch you. I am currently in the process of, um... So here's the thing. The first four videos I've actually uploaded with um, Liquidity Music. Which, if you don't know, Liquidity is the drum and bass label that I bought a license for. To be able to use on Twitch and my YouTube content. Here's the thing, though. They don't have a system where a bot can just automatically say, Oh, this channel's got a license, don't claim any of it. Like Monster Cat has. So Monster Cat, I can put the music on and it won't claim, but Liquidity, it will do anyways. And I have to go and message them and say, here, I do actually have licenses for this content. Could you please, you know, remove the claims? And they'll do it. I'm going to give them till this time. Actually, I can't give them till this time next week. I'll give them till Wednesday, Thursday. The videos went up on Wednesday, so if it doesn't get removed by like Tuesday or Wednesday, I'm going to have to re-edit the videos and re-upload them. It's going to be fine because it's just changing what the music is, so it's not too bad. It'll take an extra two hours or something. But it will mean I can't use liquidity at all during this series. Ben, can you explain to me why someone with a brand new Jaguar XF is doing DoorDash? Do you know, I've seen um, on TikTok, there's this bloke that does TikToks about DoorDash and he was going on about how like in three months he had earned like 15, 16 grand or something by doing DoorDash in three months. I'm not 100% sure how true that is. But the TikTok did say that he gotten a substantial amount of money. So, seems to be paying alright. Just depends how much he's paid on fuel out of that 17000 to then, you know, cover his running costs. Because if he's paid a lot of money for his running costs, then yeah, we, 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 we got a problem. <laughs> But who knows? I know. Come with me to the. <laughs> so bad. <laughs> Come with me to the dance floor. You and me, cause that's what it's for. My uh, coolant temperature is about 35 degrees Celsius at the moment in my PC, so it's, it's not like my PC is overheating. It's just the power supply fucking hates me. It's like, oh, I don't want the power, oh, or something. I don't, I don't even think it's that. I just physically don't know why it's doing it. I will find out when the electric bill comes through. If it's high, then we're just swapping that cooler out. <laughs> We should hopefully... I, I think on Monday we're going to play more Forza Motorsport 1. Because I want to get a substantial amount of content early. 
so that I've got a little bit of a backlog. If I can have a two week backlog of content, we're good. There we go. Nice one. And that is race over. Five minutes and one second. Not bad. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out. Yeah.